In a bill to be debated by France's lower House of Parliament this week, French MPs are questioning the lack of transparency in China's lucrative organ harvesting trade. Independent reports show the Chinese Communist Party has been harvesting organs of political prisoners without consent for about 30 years. The victims are Christians, Uyghurs, and Falun Gong practitioners. Research quoted in the bill says China conducts an estimated 60,000 to 100,000 organ transplants per year. These organs are sold to rich Chinese people, but also foreigners who travel to China for organ transplants. This practice has been denounced in an EU resolution in 2012 calling for the immediate release of prisoners of conscience in China. But it did not stop the Chinese regime from continuing to harvest organs, and one issue also remains to be addressed, the complicity of French surgeons and hospitals who help their Chinese counterparts. Head of Research and Technology Development at Salpetriere Hospital, Alexis Génin, said in a 2018 Senate hearing that there is direct cooperation between French and Chinese surgeons. Gratuit, il est anonyme. Our French organ transplant system is formidable and works great. But our best surgeons have taught and trained for the past 20 years the Chinese surgeons. What they know about transplantation, they learned it from us. The bill is supported with evidence from French hospitals' programs helping Chinese transplantation systems. In 2019, a French delegation including a top health French hospital director and the president of the National Academy of Surgery officially opened a French Chinese hospital in Shanghai. Each year, 10 cardiologists from the Asia Health Hospitals in Wuhan are trained by the Bordeaux University Hospital at a cost of approximately 90,000 euro each. This involves the cooperation of French universities, pharmaceuticals, public hospitals and surgeons. Investigative journalist Ethan Gutman presented evidence to the National Assembly on his work, interviewing Uyghurs and former prisoners of conscience. He also says pharmaceutical companies play a role. Is the issue of Chinese, uh, rather French companies, uh, trying to sell products that are directly related to organ harvesting in China and uh, one of your pharmaceutical manufacturers uh, uh, certainly is selling uh, immunosuppressive drugs to Chinese people who are carrying around a Falun Gong or a Uyghur organ in their bodies. Gutman said pharmaceutical drugs are a means to preserve health conditions of people who have received an organ. However, these drugs companies played a major role with the fast development of forced organ harvesting in China, beginning from the 90s. If the bill presented in the National Assembly is implemented, it might force French hospitals and companies to show evidence that the organs for transplant are ethically sourced. David Vives, NTD News, Paris. 